I mean, at least y'all could just laugh, chuckle a little bit, even if your girl's struggling. But if you want me to freestyle? <laughs> hey, roomies. Welcome to Jasmine's Room, and I'm Jasmine. And today, I'm pretty much doing my first YouTube video where I'm going to be sharing with you guys what this channel is about and what we're going to be doing here. So, obviously, I'm Jasmine, and I am from the Midwest, Michigan to be specific. So this is going to be a little Q&A where I'm just going to show you guys a little background. So firstly, why did I start this channel? This channel is actually kind of like a spinoff <laughs> of my original channel, Jasmine Emerald, where I pretty much went through the whole process of learning how to do YouTube, figuring out we being comfortable because I'm not going to hold y'all. First, just becoming a YouTube creator is just getting into being confident and relaxed and in your element where you feel in the vibe, you feel in who you are, you can actually present that on camera. Bro, it's a lot. I'm not even going to hold you. It's a whole freaking lot, especially if you're not used to doing it. And pretty much my original channel was to kind of get into the groove of things, figure out what type of content I was going to make. And I kind of transitioned that channel into a whole reaction channel. So this channel is pretty much to focus on the everyday girl, everyday woman. I know we're going to be doing fashion content where it's not just going to be hauls on this channel. Like if I do a haul, what I'm going to do is break down the fits for the haul, do get ready with me's with the clothes. We're going to actually break down ways in which you can wear said clothes. Because one thing about me, I'm an outfit repeater. I'm a clothes repeater. I ain't got no money to be spending on multiple things. I'm not even going I'm not even going front because the economy it's not giving. It's really not giving. And then it's also just the factor of I don't know, bro. I just don't like the idea of doing a whole bunch of hauls and not really seeing the person style them or wear them multiple times. I don't know. It's unrealistic for me, personally. So, that's what I'm going to do over here, just to help you guys out if you guys need ideas. And, you know, if you want, we could be twins. We're in the same stuff where you guys can actually get ideas from some of the fits I create. Another thing I'm going to be doing is I'm going to do dating advice, relationship advice, friend advice, which I actually did do on my other channel, and people actually really enjoyed it, and I was really excited about that, so I kind of wanted to do that over here just to not only create conversations, but if someone's going through a similar situation, I feel like it would be beneficial to potentially help them because... I'm not going to my own horn, but <laughs> I do feel like I give decent advice for the most part. People have told me multiple times I do give decent advice. I also do have a psychology degree. I don't use it. However, this will be a way for me to use it. You know, that's what we doing. I do have a decent amount of life experience. I am in my early 30s. I do have a decent amount of just I, it's been a lot of things I've gone through over the course of life and I do feel like I could bring some sort of realistic milieu some sort of actual decent commentary on you know what I would do if I was in a similar situation if you know somebody watching it could be in a, a situation or you know, just for entertaining purposes, too. I also do different reviews, uh, like, best products to have, stuff like that. I do some, you know, hair reviews, wake reviews, or whatever, and break down different ways to style them or, like, give updates and stuff like that. So, it's just going to be a plethora, <laughs> big word. It's just going to be a variety of different content I'm going to be creating here. But again, the focal point is going to be on you, girls, women. I hope you guys enjoy the content and I hope that it is helpful to you as well as entertaining.
for the most part, I just really want to create a community where we can just, you know, talk and be vibing over here where we can talk about a variety of different things, have little chit chat videos, talk about life struggles, or even just get our minds off of life. I just want this to be kind of a safe space. Yeah, be a distraction from the world because there's just so much stuff going on. So I like when I can create content that kind of takes people's minds off of things. I don't know, it just makes me feel good. I'm not gonna hold y'all. Sometimes I'll be re-watching my videos and I'm like, mm, sometimes you be funny. Sometimes, but other times I'm not gonna lie, it'd be a little awkward. So is this the first video I ever created? No, it's not. Actually, on my other channel, I've made over 100 videos within this past year. I, I really feel like if you create 100 videos, I believe it was Roberto Blake who said, create 100 crappy videos. I truly believe that because the more you create, the more you get comfortable and the more you get into your jam, get into who you are, where you can present yourself on camera and it doesn't feel forced, it just feels natural and you just feel good. So what are my hobbies? <laughs> I'm glad you asked. Firstly, I like dancing. And when I say dancing, it's definitely not synchronized. Your girl can't do synchronized. Your girl doesn't really do TikToks because I don't know what it is. My mind just can't comprehend doing motions and segments where it's one and two and three. I, can't, mm, I don't know what it is. I really don't know what it is, but my mind can't comprehend it. But if you want me to freestyle. I am a fun person to have at parties where there's music, especially music from the 90s, 2000s, 2010s, I don't know what it is. It's something about it. I almost want to do karaoke sessions on here too at some point. I can't sing, but it's fun. I like doing karaoke in person. It's really fun. And you know, a lot of y'all are probably like, wow, she seems extroverted. I'm really not. I'm actually an introvert. It's just, I have, or maybe I'm an ambivert. It is different moments in life where I am outgoing. And normally, it's on the dance floor or karaoke. But if you put me in a setting where I have to talk to people, like a board game night or something, I don't know what it is because I do have social anxiety. And I instantly just want to clam up and run the frick away. Plus, people are draining. I'm not going to lie. But when I'm alone, alone, dancing, or singing karaoke, those are the times when I'm in my element. The only times I'm in my element. Any other time, I'm kind of just awkward. My relationship status. So, actually, in April, I got engaged and... I'm going to have a whole video about that as well as just discussing some actual advice about how I kind of went from having situationships that were completely horrendous to finding someone that was actually right for me. So hopefully you guys check that video out when I post it. Where do I see myself in five years? So YouTube wise, I honestly just want to have a nice community here where you know it's just a collective of beautiful women you know because we baddies over here where it's just a collective of women where we could talk about whatever we want to talk about be real chill have fun kiki you know laugh it up you know it'll just be a real nice vibe i'm not gonna hold you i have five five years I'm going to be realistic. I would like to have 4K subscribers. And out of that 4K, maybe have a good, at least 3,000 people watching me consistently. <laughs> like, that's as realistic as I can freaking get. It would be nice to consistently make some, at least, side income money. Because, bro, I think that's one of my main goals with YouTube. I would just like to at least be able to cover my grocery bill. At least be able to cover my groceries. Because inflation be hitting and I don't like it. When I gotta go grocery shopping tomorrow. 
And, and whenever I go, I just really feel some type of weight where it just, ugh, it just really kills me. It pains me. It really does go in grocery shopping sometimes. And I love food. I enjoy food. But seeing them, them numbers, I just can't do it. It really just sends me. But <laughs> I would really like to, within a year's time, potentially be able to cover my groceries now within five years it'd be at least nice to cover like internet electricity grocery bills maybe a credit card bill you know what i'm saying phone bill but you know like i'm trying to be realistic but that's my goal for my youtube channel now as far as life hmm I just want to have a decent amount of stuff paid off, maybe a decent amount of the, our house paid off, uh, save a decent amount for retirement. I would, I would like to be healthier. I don't really, don't get me wrong, I drink a lot of water. I love water. I eat veggies. I could eat fruits more. I definitely could eat fruits more. I kind of have a juice addiction problem. We're not going to talk about it. But, yeah. Um, I feel like my food intake is okay. But I could move more. I could move in general. I pretty much will sit in the same spot. Until I have to, like, feed my dog. Take my dog out. My child. But, I mean, my dog is my child. I, I don't want kids. I would like to be healthier. Where I do more movement. And maybe I'll even create a series about that. I actually thought about that, you know, maybe taking you guys along the journey of me working out. It's going to be horrendous. I ain't going to hold you. I know I'm going to be breathing hard. Girl out of shape. But, I mean, at least y'all could just laugh, chuckle a little bit. Even if your girl's struggling. Or maybe you guys could work out with me. I don't know if you want to, but uh, would you, would you want to do that with me? For the most part, I just really want to maintain being happy, and I really just want to save. Save for retirement and save in general. Like, that's my biggest focus. Just having a decent amount of money saved and stuff paid off. That's literally the focus for me. But yeah, that's a little bit about me. I hope you guys enjoyed this first YouTube video with your girl Jasmine from Jasmine's Room. And I hope you guys subscribe if you like the vibe. You know, it's going to be a lot of fun over here. Just, we're going to have a good time. I'm excited. So, stay blessed, stay positive. I'll be seeing you soon.